All right, let's go check out this added over here. A lot of debris come down, but we can still fit in there. First look inside. I see some ventilation tubing down there. And a cool breeze coming out. That's a good sign. A fly in my face. Let's go check it out. Okay, I'm just inside the mine now. And this stretches back there for a ways. Alright, let's see where this goes. Got a mangled piece of machinery or something here on the floor. Not even sure what that is. Cool barrel right here. If that's made out of wood, I'm gonna be really impressed. No, that's metal, but uh it's still pretty impressive. And beat up. Something gave that a knock. More uh mangled equipment up here. That's really thrashed. I, uh, I'm curious about that. And let's see, well, it's even more. There's some severely damaged equipment back here. And let's see. There's a bunch of debris brock in the add it right there, but it keeps going, so I'm gonna just scramble it over that. Ventilation tubing. Oh, good. It looks like I can squeeze around that machinery. Thought I'd have to climb over that. And you know what? There's another washing machine. These guys loved washing machines. I have no idea why, but they sure did. Interesting uh, rough ceiling here. This is, I don't know if that's part of the same. I hope that's part of the same washing machine, because these guys are nuts for washing machines. All right, this uh, keeps going. Let's see where. Interesting. Got that uh, really smooth wall here on the right, and then it's all rough. On the left, there's some more equipment up here. There's uh, some tanks here. Down there. Barrel right there. And a pretty big, I assume that's a tank. Ventilation tubing hanging down. Got some ventilation tubing hanging down in front of us. A little bit of debris come down from the uh, top of the attic, but you can see how that's kind of crumbling and stuff. So I'm not surprised that's come down. Ugh. All right, looks like smooth sailing from here on out. Those are famous last words, but. I don't see anything on the you know any rubble on the floor or anything. Looks pretty, looks pretty good. That was like some kind of classifier right there. ceiling here. I would duck down a little bit. So something took off to the left here and bits of wooden stuff on the ground here. But as you can see this didn't go back very far. There's uh, some faded miners graffiti there. 
I have no idea what that says. I can't make that out. And then there's this here. A lot of rubble on the ground. I don't know if that goes up at all. Uh, oh, looks like it might go up. Well, it goes up farther than I uh, would have expected. They were uh, picking something out of there. Huh. All right, let's continue down that main uh, main at it. Okay, so that's where we just came out of. That's looking back where we came from. Down there. Now let's see what's in front of us. It just keeps going, bends around. Looks like we may have the winds here underneath our feet. Definitely have a winds. You see bits and pieces of uh, ladder going down. Trying to find an angle to see how deep that goes. Meanwhile, the uh, attic keeps going. It looks like there's a uh, branch going off to the left and one to the right up there. In regards to that winds, well, taking a closer look at this thing I thought was a winds, it's actually just like a little hole in the ground. It goes down three or four feet and that's it. So I don't know if they was being used as a sump or if they wanted to get something out of there. Who knows, but let's see what's ahead. Another barrel here. I think that says 20, 25, 26, something on the wall. Alright, the rail and the ventilation tubing go to the left. No, actually, rail goes to the right as well. So, we've got rail going back to something there. Looks like a frame of some sort. And got rail, ventilation tubing hidden off that way. Let's do right hand rules for now. That's a pretty old rail in here. Okay, that's a winch. I see a ladder going down. So this is definitely a winds. And how far down does it go? Looks like it goes down there and stops. I don't see any sign of a uh, a drift taking off from down there. I'll, I'm gonna go across to the side and take a look at it, but at least for now, I don't see any sign of that. Pretty cool winch here. Pulley up there. Oh, that's neat. See the hand crank? That would be hard work hauling up ore buckets all day. Okay, so I crossed over to the other side of that winch. Hand winch. And I'm going to see if I can tell. If there are any drifts down there. Nope. That just goes down there and stops, guys. There is not a drift taken off from there. So let's continue down this attic we're on. Okay, I've got that winch behind me, and we are continuing down this drift. rougher back here. There's more stuff on the floor. Interesting shape to be added. And I 
it keeps going. See a loop for the uh, ventilation tubing. And this, uh, so on the right and left you've got the rail and in the middle you've got a pipe for the compressor. Compressed air. And still keeps going. That's interesting, these uh, these rocks fell down from that niche, but it shows you uh, kinds of minerals they have in here. Continuing on. This is interesting. That crumbly rock right there, which gives way to this. And looks like this might be the end. Yeah. This is the end. That was a little bat right there. So let's leave the bat alone and uh, go see what's down that drift on the left back there. Okay, this is the drift we just went down. Actually, still see that winch back there, and we've got this drift on the left to go check out. The wood right there. Huh. that was fairly anticlimactic. Come back here. And that's it. Looks like they were intending to keep going. You can see how they were uh, gouging that out in the corner. But uh, for whatever reason, they stopped. Interesting rocks back here. So that is it for this edit. Let's go see if there's anything higher up. And I've got a feeling there is, based on uh, cables and such I saw going up there. And that's it for this one.